When did the Crespi surprise her say he was coming again, Nana? Oh, she, dear. Minerva Marple. And, um, tomorrow, she said. I see. Thanks, Miss Bell. So sorry for the interruption, Miss Marble. How are you finding that portrait of my beloved brother? I mean, figurative is back in vogue. And the artist who painted your brother was chosen for next year's Venice Biennale. I believe this portrait could easily fetch a quarter of a million dollars at auction. And worth every penny. <laughs> I wonder, might I get to keep my JJ for one more night so that we can say our proper tatas? I understand. I'm staying at the Five Seasons in town overnight, but I'll be around first thing in the morning. Even better, I'll have my men pack it up and deliver it to your hotel. Hmm. Well, Miss Blossom, it was a pleasure dealing with you. Should you decide to sell any other items in your collection, do let me know. I will indeed, Miss Marvel. Now that she's authenticated our original, we can swap in your perfect copy and Marvel shall be none the wiser. But what's the matter, child? Oh, nothing, Hannah. Just some upsetting news from Riverdale High. I'll be fine. Hannah Rose, I need your wisdom. My heart has once again been shattered. Oh, Miss Marple. So what do we owe this pleasure? Miss Blossom, I went to sell your brother's portrait and made the most disturbing yet fascinating discovery. It was a forgery. A very skillful forgery. And before I call the authorities, I thought we should chat. Don't you agree? Making progress? Or are you too distracted by my beauty? I'm painting you as Diana with that tay on the stag. I'm sure you'll find it satisfactory. You have a unique talent. I recognized it right away. I had to have an original Cheryl Blossom. Once this painting is finished, will you leave me in peace? I haven't decided yet. Oh, who cares? After the dagger my beloved Tony stuck in my heart, what does anything else matter? Go on. She lured me out of the house where I feel safe, just to torture me with her happiness. It's cruel, don't you think? As an outsider, it seems to me that fate has put an obstacle before you, Miss Blossom. This Tony person's happiness. And you must either rise above it, or... Throw a little chaos at it. I see we have a surprise guest. Yes. Seems like your ex is rather handsome, baby daddy's brought a friend. Oh well, if he's collateral damage, then so be it. Shall we gather everyone? It's time for some party games. It's sublime, Cheryl. Thank you, Minerva. Considering so much of my life is sheer ugliness, I'm relieved you think so. Oh, Cheryl. You made me beautiful because you're beautiful. <laughs> no, I'm not. I'm repulsive. No. Cheryl, you are, you're gorgeous. 